Stowe Acres Country Club is a popular 36-hole public course in Stowe, Massachusetts. Redesigned by Jeffrey Cornish in the mid-60s, the two courses together average 60 to 70,000 rounds a year. That kind of volume puts extra stress on the push-up style greens here, especially during the hot and dry summer of 2012. It started off as a, a very dry spring, uh, and we had a very warmer uh, than usual winter. Um, so it dates back all the way to about January where uh, we actually opened the golf course. It was an average June. Um, you know, we had our warm days, we had our you know, dry days, but all in all it was a pretty good month. Um, and, and we were starting to get pretty giddy because we thought that the golf courses were going to stay green. Then, of course, we didn't stay green and um, under, underwent quite a, a, a task of putting in 2,000 feet of transfer line tied into the south course to help water flow into the north course pond. Since becoming head superintendent here, Jason has incorporated the use of soil surfactants, or wetting agents as they are commonly known, in his greens care regimen. With our push-up style greens, uh, we have high OM, organic matter. We have, you know, uh, a higher thatch layer than, than we might really want. So we need a sprayable agent that's gonna, gonna do the job because of the heavy traffic and heavy, heavy foot, you know, foot traffic and golf play that we see. Uh, we're gonna see that water sitting, especially in May, June, July, and August, when your surface moisture is going to be at its highest because your ET rate is at its highest. You're going to want that moisture to be wicked down to where your roots are. Jason, who hand waters all of his greens, has chosen soil surfactants from Precision Laboratories to help keep the water moving. We, we throw down a four ounce shot of Cascade and um, we throw in one ounce of duplex in that mix. And, uh, and that gives us about three to four weeks of um, you know, allowable watering time to be able to continue to water. It penetrates through the soil, allows oxygen and airflow to move down through. That's the beauty of it, is that it allows whatever water is provided for the turf to move. It doesn't hold, it re-wets. So it dries down, and then it re-wets. And then it dries down some more, and then it re-wets. So keep, keep hitting it. My guys will do four, five, six rounds with a hose. According to Jason, these soil surfactants help keep his greens firm and fast, and save water. Because it's moving that surface moisture away, it's allowing you know better ball roll. It's firming up the green. Without a doubt, we save quite a bit of water on our, on our greens. Um, that goes without saying. Jason has also applied a soil surfactant in the fall and feels it helps protect against snow mold. Uh, have no real hardcore research or data or evidence, but um, just felt like it helped with snow mold because it allowed that, that surface water to continue moving. And if there's nothing down to pull that moisture down on through, then it's going to start forming and having a party under the snow. I mean, we saw some pretty good results. Yeah, do I put snow, a snow mold application down on my greens? Of course. But have I seen better results by putting the Cascade app down? Yeah. With 36 holes to manage and a limited budget, Jason has gotten Stowe Acres through the hot and dry summer with hard work and through clever use of the products and resources available. It's been an up and down year, as usual, and uh, I feel good about it. I feel good about 2012. I feel good about the play that we've had. It's been very busy and very consistent. From a maintenance side, yeah, it's a battle for us and it's tough, but from a business side, it's, it's naturally a good thing. 